When you've won as many times as he has at this age, you have these spoils. Yeah, and you knew that was coming. You could see that head pin oh. shoot off of that wall. So you saw that these two faced off twice in match play, and they split. And again, just pumping him right down the middle. He's got some nice carry, too. 259 yep. game one. And now 12, 13 years difference between these two. There's no question that Belmo had to have an influence on Simonson. Yeah, without question. Let's go! Ooh, no! No! That is not proper. Yeah, that's dirty. A break. So many shots have looked like that from him today. Another good week for Brad. We saw him on the doubles telecast a few weeks ago. Oh, no. So he hates it, and he yep. has every reason to. That is known as a Greek church. This has a worse percentage conversion than the 7-10 by about half a percentage mm -hmm. point. That's a fabulous recovery. He is three for three on that lane, and it's on. Oh, my. He didn't sound happy, but he ought to be happy. Absolutely cannot throw a ball any better than what you just saw right there. He's riding four in a row, but you know what? Belmo was riding five in a row when he got a 7-10. And that will do it! Anthony Simonson is the youngest bowler in PBA history to win two major championships, and he has defeated Jason Belmonte to do so in a rematch of 2017. This time, Simonson is your winner. Straighter was greater, and Anthony Simonson again. 22 years old. Anthony, we just talked about how hard fought this match was. You know, and he had some high praises for you. Um, talk to me about what was happening on the lanes because when everyone was going left, it looked like you were going right. Yeah, well, uh, once we got into match play this week, I kind of decided to kind of camp out a little to the right, uh, not really give the three pin away too much, and I uh, you know, was fortunate enough to pull away some streaks. Uh, the fifth frame, a little distraction. I just put that behind me. I knew I had a good ball reaction. Just had to make a couple good shots, and... Uh, you know, two years ago when I bowled Belmont in the finals, he got the hits. Uh, this year, it didn't go his way. To beat uh, one of the best bowlers in the world, I'm truly speechless. You are the youngest person ever to win two majors. Put in words how that feels. Uh, incredible. Uh, you know, I, I didn't really have any words when I won the Masters. And then to have number two, I, like I said, I'm really just speechless. <laughs> And you got to do it against Jason Belmonte, who everyone is thinking he's one of the best in the world. Yeah, uh, he's a guy that, you know, I, I've been bowling two-handed all my life. Once Jason got on the scene uh, and, you know, I saw somebody that, oh, you can do this, uh, you know, he's a big motivation for me. I want to be the best in the world. And, uh, you know, you got to start by beating him. Anyone you want to dedicate this to? Uh, I just want to thank a couple friends that came out and watched. Uh, they drove 17 hours overnight to come watch me. That is some good friends right there. And right now, I'd like to welcome the commissioner, Tom Clark, for the trophy presentation. Anthony and Bellamo, incredibly exciting. Thanks for delivering. On behalf of the PBA and our players and our great membership, congratulations, champion of the PBA Players Championship. Congratulations to Anthony Simonson on his second major win. Well, Randy, he earned it. He beat the best. He used a strategy that nobody else had in their bag today. And Anthony Simonson is a deserving major championship for the second time now he's a major winner.